Double R base side train line, go up on butter chicken, a double digit waistline, stubble on my face like when I'm on a plane ride. People don't want to sit on the same side. What? Look at me, I'm harmless. I'm wearing a tank top. What could I be Hey, what's up, Toe? It's Monday morning and it's week 10. So I'm starting to think about exams and how I'm going to nail the memory aspect of them. Come up with this list of uh, ways that I can improve my memory before exams come around to try and do better. Uh, some obvious ones like early nights wherever possible, um, go easy on drinking and smoking, uh, and then there's some more obscure things like meditating, uh, writing down your dreams. Writing down dreams is like, it's like the brain is a muscle so trying to recall information from the night before or earlier in the morning. Uh, is a way to kind of strengthen it. I think it works. I've, I've read in a lot of places that it does. Um, so I'm starting doing that writing down dreams thing today. And right here is this morning's dream. So I can tell you a little bit about this morning's dream with the help of some storyboarding from James Foley. So basically I'm on a night out and I meet the Athlone lads in a late bar and even though it's past closing uh, I trick the bouncer into letting me in and he does and then I go and sit with the lads and then the bouncer comes down and he's like oh you tricked me uh, but you know well done here's a round of drinks for everyone so then he gives us a round of drinks then he comes back down to the table later and uh, he tells us that Migos, a trio of rappers, is having a little meetup just down the road from the bar. For some reason I have a bike so I cycle down and I get there first before everyone else. And they're like sitting in this like white press room. There's like snacks laid out, uh, two out of the three members are there. I think it's Offset and Quavo. Uh, Takeoff isn't there for some reason but his chair is empty so I sit down in his chair. But then, uh, later on, I, I get to interview them because that was just the dynamic that happened. All these like TV and like newspaper cameras came in, and because I was sitting in the chair, I just end up interviewing them. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense. One of the questions that I ended up asking them was, were they ever going to do a live rendition of the song Familiar, featuring Chance the Rapper? And uh, they said, yeah, maybe we'll do it someday. And then anyway, after the interview, they're like... Yeah, now we're gonna have a concert next door. And everyone in this room is invited backstage. All of us went backstage. The concert was good. And uh, then everything goes dark. And there's like this like puff of smoke comes across. And it's like... And then Chance the Rapper like comes up from the floor. And they do Familiar. Uh, which was really good. And uh, I rush the stage and managed to get there, get up to chance before the security gets to me and I managed to uh, talk to him and uh, yeah, it was a great dream, <laughs> would recommend Cardboard cut out, sharp teeth, smart mouth, okay. smile big, small ways, big Oh no, not giving it to you Um, thanks to James Foley for storyboarding this. Uh, he's great at drawing comics. Where she come from, damn, I don't know But I think I seen the end chance in me goes video Her body look like a coke bottle But I'ma let her do the swallow Her she chasing after my dog Hit the bucket from the back, make a